going for six there as well. And Kleister, Celis, Hinga so far, none of them have dropped a set. Celis hopes to keep that intact during this match. Johansson is surprised. Hing is probably not a surprise. 15 love. And probably not a great surprise that those three have not lost a set. on the Porsche radar gun. But that was that wide one, which is really built for finesse and for spin, and it landed well up the line. That is wide. 15 all. 15 all. There's a wide expression on her face, yeah, Pam, is. but is that there all the time, or is, uh, no. is this different? Well, not all the time. We've, we've seen it a couple of times in this tournament, though, and when we saw the off-pace serve, wondered whether or not the knee, and, and we'll look at her movement a little bit, because this tendonitis thing can flare up, and she's certainly under more stress here than other matches. Oh! 40 to 50. Yeah, it looks a little ginger to me the way she's walking. Watch this. See, she's got to land on that left knee on the serve. Game of Williams. That's where she pulls up. Yeah. But she holds on, and it's even for a piece. Let's see what she said. Trainer. Trainer. Yes. Uh oh. Yeah. You can actually hear where they're saying yes. Uh, that was a tone of, of concern. Ladies and gentlemen, the trainer has been called to the court. We talked about it the other night, Pam, that her body looks more fragile than her sister, who is uh, seems is more sturdily built. Oh, well, definitely there's two different builds, but both of the Williams sisters have had their share of injuries. Serena's the one that's out with the ankle sprain. That's Carrie Brooks, who was hired as the full-time physical therapist, athletic trainer for the Williams sisters, and she's done a great job getting Venus over the initial sting of the tendonitis of a few days ago and I talked to Carrie a couple days ago and she said it was much better but obviously Venus is having problems again with it when you see her land like we showed you on that slow-mo replay I mean it is it's a serious punch that the knee gets also the uh, WTA trainer who's out there now is the one that can only care for the players on the court not your own personal trainer the bandage on the left knee here's the ace you can see her land look how she kind of turns outside it's interesting to see how she puts the weight on their outside of her shoe and she knew right away she was going to ask for the trainer and i think it's the right leg well we'll take a break and we'll update you when we come back venus williams being attended to looks like she's ready but we'll be back Venus Williams disappeared into the tunnel to be attended to there, and she is now back out. Meanwhile, Monica Sell is trying to keep herself warm. It's the um, right leg. You can see the strapping. So she's done something to the opposite leg, and that's why she had to leave the court. And that happens sometimes, Ben, doesn't it? When you're trying to accommodate one injury, sometimes you hit something else. Well, that's why the look of concern, she probably would have been less concerned if it was the knee because that's something she's familiar with and is being treated for now. But this is now a new one. For all, first set. We've seen Capriati with some strapping on her hips. You know, you've got the hip flexor muscle, you've got groin muscles, both of whom take a big pounding on the tennis court with all the side-to-side -side movement. Fifteen love. Ball. Thirty love. Said it the other day, playing against Celis. Also, she hits the ball very flat, Pam. It's not. You have to cover a lot of territory against her. Moves you side to side, goes for the lines. Yeah. 
And it doesn't take a genius to figure out that uh, one of the real pluses that Venus Williams has as a player is her mobility. Can't change directions there. Sellis on the tournament up till now, 35 forehand winners, 25 backhand winners. That's a nice balance. I've always wondered which side Monica would rather hit, say, the biggest shot of her life. Would it be on the forehand or the backhand? Big power there from Venus Williams against Brandy of the USA. Christine Brandy was, was hardly mobile, frankly, with that knee. But uh, so she doesn't need mobility all the time. But against somebody like Celis, yep. she just needs it. Different story. You can see her face there, very, very concerned. Game Celis. Celis holds on. We're on serve the first set. The question is, will Venus last out this match with her injuries? Five four. Venus Williams to serve, and we come back. Venus Williams to serve. Four, five, first set. And the last time we saw Good Venus team, Williams man. serve was hitting a big serve and then needing the injury timeout. And we'll see whether or not the serve is what really aggravates this hip 13. groin. I'm not quite sure what it is, but something on the upper right leg. You know, we come up with all these statistics first serve uh, percentages and break points won and lost. It's uh, we need an injury statistic for this event. It it has been one of the players here from before the event started. Agassi out with an injury. Serena Williams out with an ankle. An, an endless number of injuries here during the tournament. Five games all. Five apiece. First set is really important here for Venus Williams' attitude if she goes down in this first set. She may just feel like she's had enough. If she wins it, obviously she's going to stay out and see if she can close Sellers out. She said after her match with Brandy that had she been playing against one of the top players, she probably would not have played or not lost it. Well, injuries force you a lot of times to focus in a different way and to go for shots you wouldn't normally go for, and that's what I think we saw in that one from Venus. You can see she really doesn't want to stop. When she gets moving into one direction, she doesn't want to have to plant the foot and come back. Sides. 15, and Venus Williams pulling her from side to side, She's two hands off both sides, but she got a very good angle on that one. Did she ever? Venus is actually looking like she's moving okay. It's obviously not great, but her big concern with the first couple of games, would she injure it further? How would the strapping help? times an injury is about sort of getting used to it and, and sort of gaining confidence in the fact that you can play with certain injuries and this is that critical time with for Venus game point Celis One. 
one-hander there from Sellers. Vain effort. Deuce. Big, big Jeez. points to follow. And you mentioned, Cliff, the importance of this first set. And if Venus Williams can break here and serve one big service game, then she can be one giant step closer to her second semifinal. Does not want to be out here for three sets. Isn't it? Uh, and Mike Sal, her coach, really likes it. As Salas is so brilliant at being able to hit the ball from behind her. You can see here, is that behind her? You bet. She gets that little wrist thing going. That was tremendous shot at Deuce, five all. She's not shy on guts. Improvised shot works fine. Game point, Salas. That's for Salas. Sellers has a 6-5 lead. She's never beaten Venus Williams, who is both the Wimbledon and the U.S. Open champ. She holds both titles right now. For the former number one, and she will play the winner of the match we're watching now. 15 love. 15 love to Williams at 5-6. On a normal off day, she'll go out and hit twice a day, but now she's been putting ice, ice, ice on that knee, never to rehab it. Been hitting once a day. Six on the Porsche radar gun. Not her best power serve, but still pretty good. Game point. That's the first to seven with a two-point lead to decide this first set. The thing that uh, would really bother me if I were in Venus Williams' shoes, Pam, and I'm sure you don't know the answer to this question, is whether these injuries now that she is suffering here in Australia are sort of chronic, whether, or is this something that hopefully is here today, gone tomorrow? Who knows? That's wide one to Williams. Remember that uh, wrist tendonitis that she had a couple of years ago? Yeah, two years ago. Kept her out of the first four months of the year, including this Australian Open. She plays with both wrists strapped. One to Williams, mini break. One on. And hands it back with a double. Venus's third double fault is seven aces. from Venus Williams prior to that point she'd only won Two, four one, of twelve Williams. when she got in the first serve uh, excuse me the second, second serve right. she's 16 of 19 when she gets that first delivery in 
One, two. did not play as a kid many uh, age group tournaments a lot of you know, questions and USTA play development at that time concerned that she wasn't playing enough that's for certain. there's lots of pathways as neither player I think likes that call but even Celis didn't play many junior tournaments for a long time Venus is 21 now. And albeit that she didn't play many tournaments, she was still out there practicing, so Three, she probably two, took as many steps on a tennis court as those who did play a lot of tournaments. It's a really good serve by Monica Sells. The lefty out wide on the deuce court. 3-2. Two Williams players will change hands off to six. See how tall Venus is when she walks past that net post. Mom's was that mom was laughing a lot during warm-up. We were watching her. She was having a great time. There's a little more, more of a look of concern on the face of Brandy Williams, who once again is looking after her daughters down here, although Serena's been on the sideline. Oh, yeah, very sweet on that one. Controlled forehand, clean winner, 5-2, Williams. Williams. A couple of huge points for Sellis. It's 119 miles an hour. Wow. Point from Celis. Keeping Venus moving. Desperation from both players. For Venus oh, Williams, it's on this stretch Williams. right here. And for Monica, it's desperation to stay in this tiebreak. 3-5. a good return because it was a very good second serve six three. set points Williams. three of them here for venus williams venus with her hands on her hips even though she's up these set points she's burdened right now these injuries are paying its toll thing as uh, she's attacking immediately she really doesn't have any choice Six, Monica Sellers Williams still set point from both players when it was all said and done though venus williams in the tie break and she has won the first set she is working hard watch this probably harder than she would like considering her injuries 